All right, y'all, welcome back. It's Albert LaBelle in the lock. We're going to take a look at this time is right here. It is this so-called high security disk detainer lock. Um, as you can tell, it's got a lot of writing on here that I cannot translate. Uh, there's no way. Uh, well, Venus. That's about the best I can do with that. But yeah, it's a 40 millimeter disc detainer lock. I think it's comical though. Some of the, uh, some of the artwork they use. Uh, if you look at this closely, hopefully we can get it to focus. This one right here, it, it looks like, you know what? Let me get this off here. That's where the plastic's not interfering. This one right here looks like it's, uh, you know, don't use the wrong key. Maybe we got some sad face in the key ring there. This one here looks like a crowbar. Uh, so don't use a crowbar on it. This one here looks like don't smack it with a steel pole of some sort. But this one here really cracks me up because it shows like a drill. But the lock looks happy. It's even given a peace sign. So maybe the lock likes to be drilled out. I don't know. I just find it all very comical. <laughs> so yeah, uh, very, very special there. But yeah, they call this a high security lock. I mean, it says so right here in the lock high security and just look at those high security keys huh good lordy lord and if i count let's see it would figure one two three four five six probably seven disc uh so yeah very very special high security i think not um another thing it showed and we might have to give that a test uh, if we can get it picked open uh, it did say up here in this very, very small writing, um, lock shackle with special treatment, higher hardness, toughness stronger, uh, special craft treatment with long life, uh, the internal structure of the body is firm with high safety factor. Yeah, very, very comical. So, yeah, we'll give some of that a test, but let's see if we can't pick into it. Uh, it did show, I think, that it's double ball locking. Yes, it is. Double ball locking. So, that's cool. That's a that's a plus size, or a plus side to that. Let me grab the sparrows. Actually, let me grab a rotator. Uh, here we go. This one right here will work. Rotate all the discs clockwise. I'm just going to grab the sparrows disc tool with uh, my homemade tip in it. And we're just going to drop it in the bottom. And let's see if we can't get this thing picked. Let's flip that around. I like showing that. All right. Just hold it good for the camera here. Make sure we only got one disc. All right. Let's see if we can't pop this puppy. That one feels uh, iffy. There we go. Finally got one that's uh, tight. Okay, had one that's tight. I can tell you it feels really, really rough in this lock. All right, I got to go back down already. Surely we've missed something. There's got to be more than two discs we need to rotate I'd imagine iffy all right I'm not holding it straight all right let's make sure that bottom one is a zero did we get it already we did. My goodness, I had to rotate like two discs. So let's find out why. That was ridiculously easy. <laughs> even for me, I've gotten pretty good with these, but even for me, that was easy. So let's look at the key. So what I'd figured out is I had to move like two discs. And what I'm going to guess is it was probably this one and this one because they're the deepest cuts. That means these other slight cuts, the uh, gates on the discs are so wide 
that I didn't even have to turn those because the gate, like I said, it's so wide. It can be, say, uh, anything from a zero to like a four probably, and the lock's still going to open. So I only had to move this disc and that one, and that was it. So, yeah, um, I'm sorry, but uh, high security? I think not. So let's take it a step further. Just because it shed, said the shackle was hardened, we're going to have to find out. Let's just go back here somewhere. Let me get the rough side of this, and let's just see. No, it's chewing right into that bad boy. So it's not a hardened shackle. So yeah, high security? Uh, no, I don't think so. <laughs> so this one gets a thumbs down from me all day long. Sorry, but yeah, way too easy to pick. Definitely not hardened. Uh, so yeah, thumbs down. Okay, that's it. Thank you all so much for watching. Uh, if you're not subscribed yet, please do so. It really helps out a lot. And all the cool people are doing it. So if you want to be cool, you got to subscribe or you're going to get left out. That's all I can tell you. All right. Thank you so much. Thank you.